What's up, guys? Welcome back. Episode 5. This is a Mail Call Monday. Uh, we're going to take a look at some things I got in the mail, some TTMs, some recent uh, card uh, box break uh, returns from Island Breaks again, like I featured in one of my other videos, as well as a couple uh, items uh, on the Funko side. Um, but before we get into that, just got to point out today's show will be co-hosted by these guys in front of you. got North Carolina, Michael Jordan. U.S. poster boy, Christian Pulisic, nature boy, Ric Flair, and the amazing little sweet Dr. Pepper icon. Um, they will be following along for the show. Uh, make sure you guys go ahead and follow me at Huncho Pop. Oh, struggling. At Huncho Pop on Instagram. This is where I post information for box breaks, giveaways, which I do have a giveaway going on right now. Make sure you guys check that out. You can win a Funko Pop or a card blast, a hockey blaster box. Um, just off of simply subscribing and following me on Instagram. Um, but the details will be over there. I'm also doing a box break that includes a value pack, absolute uh, absolute value pack, absolute blaster, a mosaic blaster, as well as a Panini XR hobby box that's going to be random division. So you guys go ahead and check that out. I have two spots filled. Need six more before I uh, go ahead and rip that. But all the details that will be on my Instagram at Huncho Pop. Um, and then today... To start it off, I'm going to start with some TTMs that I have recently got in the mail. They're going to be three basketball ones. Um, as a start, the first one is from the 76ers. It is Hershey Hawkins. As you can see there, he signed on this 92 uh, upper deck. I really like these cards with the like basketball flooring border. Uh, but you can see there you had his number. Um, nice blue, blue ink, really nice cards. Um, this one, I think, I want to say it took maybe two weeks uh, to come in. Uh, I forgot to actually track the length of these ones, but this one I took two weeks, um, and he does sign for free, um, so really a uh, big pickup there. Let's go ahead and get him on a stand. Next one up is was from Akron, Ohio. Akron, nah, not LeBron, I wish. Uh, but Larry Nance, not Junior, but Larry Nance Sr. on this skybox. Uh, you can see right there he signed his name and has the number 22 on there. Dunk Contest Champion, father of Larry Nance Jr., who's on the Cavs now. Um, but a really nice card, really nice signature. Skybox, my only complaint is that they put a lot of dark backgrounds on these cards, and sometimes they're so hard to see when you sign, but... Luckily, this blue ink, you can see pretty well. And then the last one for my TTMs I have, uh, it was two returns. I sent this card, Ralph Sampson. Centered, this one's him in the, uh, when he was on the Kings, 92, upper deck. Uh, but this card, um, this, sorry, this player, uh, Ralph Sampson, absolute legend in college basketball at Virginia. Um, just a dominant big man. Uh, but this one, I believe, took about a week and a half. Um, so this was a pretty fast return uh, and was <clears throat> free as well. The cool thing about Ralph Sampson is that when you do send to him, he also sends you uh, this for his found from his foundation. So I didn't even like sign or ask for this, but he sent this back with my card. Um, you can see it's the Sampson Family Foundation card, and he signed that one as well. So it's pretty cool. Uh, Sports Illustrated cover from Virginia, which is pretty awesome that I didn't even ask for this and it came with it. So cool pick up there. Um, the next thing we have is, I think this is, yeah, this is maybe from a break that I did with Island Breaks just to see some of these rookie hits. It was a random team and I have like four teams or so, but I think this little packet right here has the biggest Pools. And we had a Chase Claypool absolute rookie. We had, and then two Jerry Judy rookies. Very nice. And then this one, I think this had some more of the rookies in here in this pack. It's kind of a lot. It's kind of stuffed in there. Um, but this one had a green. Green Parallel Jake Fromm. Uh, 
some base, Tredavious White, Josh Allen, Josh Allen, Stephon Diggs, Red Zone, Josh Allen. I like these cards because they're, they're pretty cool. They're different. Cool action shots. We have Epidenza, Zach Moss, Fantasy Flashback, Thurman Thomas. Pretty cool cards. I feel like nobody played fantasy football. So for them to make fantasy football cards of players at this time, when probably no one was playing fantasy football, I think it's pretty funny. Jake Fromm, Jake Fromm. I'm banking on Jake Fromm to be a legend out of nowhere because we've got a lot of Jake Fromm. Thurman Thomas, Zach Moss, AJ Epinesa, and Odell Mosaic, Nick Chubb, Nick Chubb, Baker Mayfield, Donovan Peoples-Jones, Minka Fitzpatrick, Juju, Big Ben, a green Minka. Introductions Claypool. That's a really nice one. I like those introductions cards. Stargazing, Juju Smith, and another Chase Claypool. So some pretty cool pulls from that. I believe I also had like the Jets again in this one. So I only got a bunch of Jamal Adams that it's not even on the team. Um and then, so yeah, that's it for that break with Island Breaks. Make sure you guys check them out at Island Breaks. They do a ton of breaks and really good prices as well. So definitely check them out. The next thing I have is something for my new collection that I'm starting with my Funko Pops. It was like one of the first ones come in. I wish I had it when I did the Leaf Draft Box, but it is the college mascot Funko Pops. I'm starting to collect those. So those ones will slowly start to come in. But this one is the first one to come in and it's the Harry the Husky from the University of Washington. I just think these are cool. They're probably not gonna like go up in value, but I just I'm like a big sports fan and a big college football fan. Uh, so getting these are pretty cool. This one's flocked. Uh, for those that aren't familiar with Funko Pops, flocked means that it has like a texture on the pop. So this one kind of like has a suede. So it's supposed to like mimic fur, uh, but not all of them get that. So this one's more of a exclusive one, um, mostly because Funko's located in Seattle. Uh, so this one is, one of my newest ones to my collection, Harry the Husky. Um, you can see some of the more, some more coming in. I have, I'm a USC fan, so this one was the first one I got, but it's not, hasn't came in yet. And I also got Big Al, and I wanna say Mike the Tight. No, Brutus Buckeye for Ohio State. He's not on this box, but I will be slowly getting these ones um, in. So you'll definitely start to see some of these college mascots slowly rolling in on these videos. And then the next ones I have, I have a, Two Funko sodas, for those not really familiar with that. It is a Funko, like, pop, kind of, um, but it does come in like a soda can. It's usually like vintage logoing, um, usually limited number of items. Uh, but this one is Freddie Mercury. Um, and you can either get a common one, which looks like this, or a chase one that's going to be a lot more rare and a lot more limited that'll have a different variation. Um, so I figured why not get this one see if possibly get the chase. So I have no idea what it is. So you're finding out as I'm finding out. So let's go ahead and rip the seal off this. And so it opens up like that. And usually inside there's like a little black bag. And then at the bottom of the bag, there is, or the tin, there is like a little coin and it'll usually tell you if you get a chase or not. And based off of this one, we got the chase. Oh, that's amazing. That is awesome. So this one, the regular looks like that with a yellow jacket. So this one, I'm not prepared to open this. Dang, I should have. If we take a look at this one. He is wearing the metallic jacket as opposed to the yellow one. So this one, there's actually only 3,300 of this version. And I got one, one of one. I didn't even have to buy like six um, or anything. I hate glitter, it's already on my finger. Um, but that is super unexpected, um, super cool come up. So this is definitely gonna have some good value to it. Only 3,300 of this style available. So that is pretty nice. Try to slowly put these back into this just to keep it nice. We'll put the little soda tab in there. Close this up. And put Freddy off to the side. And then this next one is 
from a Whatnot auction. Whatnot app is an app where you can buy and sell Funko Pops and it's like one of the best, easiest ways to do it. So I definitely recommend if you guys are interested in those to check that out. They do Pokemon cards too. I'm, I'm not really into Pokemon cards, but um, eventually I do sports cards are gonna get put on there. Um, so I'll be on there doing that, but I buy and sell on the Whatnot app at Huncho Pop as well. Um, if you guys reach out to me, I can give you a uh, referral code that gets $3 off uh, of your first purchase. And yeah, get you guys in, uh, get you guys in that. They do auctions so you can buy stuff. Usually people sell all kinds of Funko, all kinds of cool collectible things. This one is from a buddy of mine. Uh, his Instagram is at G Serrano. Uh, he's like really big in the whatnot community. Um, and I got this Samurai Jack uh, soda from him. This one's only 10,000 total. Uh, so even more limited than that one. Um, and it does come with a chase as well. So it could be a very small amount um, as well. Hopefully we get that. If not, still cool because Samurai Jack's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and check that out. Definitely check out Whatnot app. It's probably the easiest place to buy Funkos. Plus you get like the cheapest like shipping option possible when it comes to Funko products. That's where I got the Washington one. Actually, all of the pops you're looking at except for... Michael Jordan I got. Oh my god, this one is stubborn. Except for the Michael Jordan one I got on whatnot. So let's see, we have the bag here. We're gonna take this coin out. Coin tab. I don't know what to call this. All right, here we go. And it is the common. So it is the regular Samurai Jack. Um, one out of 8,400. It's okay, because I got it for 15, which is pretty much retail. And this is not gonna open, is it? Oh, it's not gonna open. There we go. Usually I don't open the sodas, but for video's sake, I figured if those who are not familiar, might as well show it. But here is the Samurai Jack. And yeah, so um, with that, just want to say thank you guys for watching. Uh, make sure you guys go ahead and check out my Instagram at Huncho Pop. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Uh, to my channel. I plan on posting at least usually three videos per week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Um, if not, maybe more depending on when stuff comes in the mail and whatnot. Uh, but definitely check out my Instagram for my giveaway as well as uh, sports car breaks. Um, and also go ahead and download that Whatnot app and reach out to me if you guys want to get discounts on that or if you're in collecting or anything like that for Funko products. Um, but yeah, that pretty much sums it up for this video. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.